Good smile. Yeah. <laughs> this is the meal that we have I feel like it has been such a long time since we've just indulged in some delicious Filipino food. This here is happiness in a bowl. That crunch though. That crunch. So you have this and this. It's the perfect combo. What is up guys, welcome to a brand new vlog. Today a very, very special vlog. Nelly and I have once again come up to Tagai Tai for actually the total lunar eclipse this evening, but that's gonna be its own video. We thought we'd finally get a chance to take a look at one of the places that is very, very highly recommended here on this channel. We finally get to check out the Escala Hotel here in Tagai Tai. We're actually gonna give the restaurant Bellissima a try. We're just gonna browse through the menu, see what there is to eat, but guys, Look at this view. stunning, stunning view. I mean, this is only can get more stunning if we have Nelly in the frame as well. Aww. <laughs> right? It's really beautiful. It's okay, I just said to Mike, it's really good that you don't hear anything from the street side, but rather from the nature side. We just hear crickets here, which is um, quite soothing for yeah. this view. <gasps> Go shake. So many crickets, some might say I told a joke. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're starting off with a lovely ripe mango shake. Nelly, how is it? Mm, perfect. Perfect? Mm. Nice. It's really good. And we decided to order a few Filipino dishes. Obviously, we're in Tagay Thai, so we need to have a bulalo. Um, it's one of the most popular dishes from Tagay Thai, and I am a huge, huge fan. Then we have an ensalada mango, mango, ensalada, I forgot the exact name, but it's a Filipino salad. We have some spring rolls, we have some liempo, which I'm also very excited, haven't had liempo in such a long time. Uh, and yeah, we have the stunning view. <laughs> Mom, I think this is what you're craving for. Oh, yes. That's wow. Fresh salad. Greek salad. Mm -hmm. I know you're familiar with this. <laughs> Look at that smile! <laughs> yeah, big smile, obviously. Spring roll. Spring roll. It's got a spring roll. You right. said it's uh, filled with sisik? Sisik. Yeah. yeah. Mm. I must say that this salad looks really good. Yeah. Very excited for this. Yes. Should I just uh, give the spring rolls a try? You have no idea how pretty it looks right now. Seeing you sitting there with this amazing food, with this amazing view. I know, right? All right. And this is the meal that we have cooked. That is so good. Mm. Crunchy. A touch of sweetness from the chili sauce. And when you have this beautiful, savory, crunchy sisik in the middle. So many flavors, so many textures. Mm. Sounds Just very crispy. To that sound. <laughs> mm. Oh wow, the soup is huge. Good for, I would say, four or six people. Maybe we should ask a neighbor and pool if they want some. <laughs> we also got some liempo. Mm. I feel like it has been such a long time since we've just indulged in some delicious Filipino food. I mean, we had. Filipino food, but very, very healthy. So with our meal plan, so. Ah. Okay, I'm going to do the bulalo taste test. I'm going to take this corn and put it on my plate because I want to get all the goodness that is in here. You see this beautiful broth with some pearls on top that has probably a lot of flavor from the bone marrow. Oops. I just love the taste of a light soup that is still nice and salty, has a little bit of richness to it with the bone marrow. I don't know, this reminds me so much of my childhood. My mom used to make soups like this for me. Not Filipino soups, but similar ones. Very good. 
And this here is happiness in a bowl. I'm hunting for something very specific. And it is the bone marrow. Oh yes. So I want to get a piece with the bone marrow and some of these lovely just falls Oops. apart beef here. There's just something magical that happens when you take a big chunk of meat and bones and bone marrow and just simmer it for hours, like the flavors that come out of it. It's so good. And we also have some nice meat in there that just falls apart and it's super, super delicious. Mm. Meat that just melts in your mouth. I don't know what's up with these British people cutting their corn. Yeah, it's just one of my pet peeves. I just, I don't like biting into a corn because I get all these like stringy things between my teeth. Well, that's the fun part, right? <laughs> just the fun part of eating corn. <laughs> so I'm gonna try the Filipino salad, which has some lovely mango here. I'm guessing it's probably a green mango, so a very sour, um, fresh mango. It has some chilies, it has some red onion, and then it has the shrimp paste. So I'm gonna grab a little bit of this. In here. Mixed. Mix, mix. Hello, hello. And then get a big bite. Mm. Oh, yeah. So it's very, it's not the, the mango isn't that sour, but it's very refreshing. And I like the combination, the mix of the tomato, the mango and the shrimp paste gives it that umami, shrimpy, uh, fishy, salty taste. spring rolls I don't know why but for some reason I was just craving spring rolls so these are actually filled with sisig okay. we have some chili sauce here Ooh. that crunch though that crunch mm. look at that filled with some meaty goodness in there I think there's even some cheese in there I think we have some, it's called atachara mm. with some cabbage, carrots, chili. And while this is a little bit more on the heavy side, the salad balances it out. So you have this and this, it's the perfect combo. So next up we have this beautifully charred and grilled liempo. I'm gonna dip it into the vinegar here. Mmm, charred, slightly sweet, very savory. And when we have the freshness of the vinegar, mmm, miss this kind of Filipino food, man. Oh, and by the way, we were turning down our emotions a little bit because there were people sitting right next to us. <laughs> we didn't want to disturb them. We didn't want to make a scene. <laughs> but yeah, this is phenomenal, really good food. So as you saw, we are going for round two and three for the Bulalo. <laughs> Definitely worth it. Um, I'm going to show you around in the restaurant just to show you what a nice ambience they have here. And of course, I'm going to start with the impeccable view that we have from this viewing deck, I would say. Then over here, we have the Escala Hotel with this stunning infinity pool. And right behind me, you see the actual restaurant. I fit in perfectly today with my outfit. Uh, I didn't know that it's in black and uh, wood. Looks really good, I love the combo. There is enough space for social distancing. And they actually have in an open kitchen concept, so you can have a sneak peek into the kitchen. So here we see what's going on in the kitchen. 
Oh, nice yeah, to meet yeah. you. Can Hi. Can I have a picture with you? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Yeah, and then you have the actual lobby area, which is mind-blowing. It's such an incredible view with the infinity pool here. I mean, look at that. Look how stunning. Wow, guys, what a feast. We especially love the Bula Lo and the Spring World. Absolutely mind-blowing. The food is very well worth coming here. And if not just the food, then also this fantastic view. I'm guessing around sunset you could really have a beautiful dinner here as well. They have some western dishes on the menu as well that I hope we can come and try out sometime soon. I've heard very good things about the burger as well. Uh, if you enjoyed today's vlog be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you are new. In tomorrow's vlog we're going to give you a tour of this hotel. We They were kind enough to uh, show us around the property as well so definitely check that out. And yeah, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Same time, same place. Remember to stay awesome, be positive, and make it happen. Bye-bye.